Welcome back to the Daily BS. My name is Doug Larson with the Barbell Shrug Podcast. Our question today is about workout shakes and if you need to have a workout shake at every single workout, even if you're doing two a days. So in my opinion, yeah, if you train, you should have a workout shake. So if you train twice a day, no problem, just have a workout shake at each training session. Um, basically what it is, is kind of automatic carb cycling. You have more carbohydrates in the form of sugar that's in your workout shake on the days that you train. And if you train twice a day, then you have even more sugar um, on that day. And so you have higher carbs on the days that you train more often. If they're very short training sessions, if you're doing a 10 minute AMRAP, well, that's not a real training session. When I say a training session, I usually mean you know, up to an hour of working out. If you do a 10 minute AMRAP, uh, you might be able to skimp on your, uh, on your workout shake for something that short, but if you're training you know, with a, a full uh, strength session, you're doing you know, heavy snatches, heavy cleans, maybe some squats, and then you do you know, a 20 minute AMRAP afterward, and you're doing a full training session, then yes, you should definitely have a workout shake um, during a, a major training session like that. Uh, and then really the answer, or the real answer is, um, you know, are you gaining body weight and you're, you're trying not to gain body weight? Or do you feel like you're not leaning up as fast as you're trying to lean up to? You know, what are, you, what are your goals right now? If you are trying to you know, peak for a competition and you're already super lean and you're trying to have as much energy as possible during your workouts and you want to recover as fast as possible, then definitely have those workout shakes. Uh, if you are trying to lean up as fast as possible, well, maybe once in a while, you still have a workout shake with a scoop of two of protein, but you, you cut down the, the sugar or the carbohydrate portion of the shake. So it'll kind of vary depending on what your goals are, body composition wise and energy wise leading up to competition or if you're in the off season or what have you. But a, a good blanket statement is if you train, you should have a workout shake. Uh, and for the most part, that's a good decision. So if you have more questions about workout shakes, uh, what to put in them or any other nutrition questions related to training, you can always go to barbellshrug.com, uh, click the Ask a Question tab at the top of the page, and we can do a daily BS on it in the future.